Pwede pa po ba ito? Nagilis yung ulan? Okay na po ba ito? Magbuhos na ngayon yung ulan? Okay pa daw. Pero lumalakas na. <laughs> Welcome to Pospray Simplify. Thanks for joining us in our home build journey. We are now on week 9 and our target is to pour concrete this week. We lost one birthday on Monday because of the rain. But today we praise God for the good weather. The team is finalizing the slab by installing the electricals. While they're doing that, they're checking weather updates to see which day it's best to pour concrete this week. Wednesday seems to be the best option with just 20% chance of rain. So, Wednesday it is. Good morning everyone. It's now Wednesday, July 1st. It's 6.30 in the morning and we're on our way to the project site. Today is Buhas Day or Pouring Concrete Day. And so we're so excited because God gave us a beautiful morning with cloudy skies and if you just look at the clouds it's so beautiful the sky is so beautiful it's like god placed some cotton balls in the sky for our enjoyment so praise the lord we hope that the weather would be perfect today just cloudy skies not too hot because the guys will be pouring concrete and we hope and i pray that there will be fresh winds so that it's not too uncomfortable for them. So yeah, thanks for praying with us. Good morning everyone. We are now here at the project site and the team is doing the final preparations for the pouring of concrete. They're just cleaning the whole thing because obviously you, need, you cannot have debris and stuff on the slab before you pour concrete. This is actually my first time to see pouring of concrete. My husband used to work in the Middle East. Both of us used to work in the Middle East. He worked in Saudi Arabia for four years as a, as a site engineer and in Dubai as a site engineer and QAQC engineer, senior QC, Q, QAQC engineer. And so every time we would say, my buhos kami or we will be pouring concrete, he would come home late or early in the morning. Talagang walang tumulog and all that. But, um, this will be my first time to see him in action. And yeah, may the good Lord bless us, be with us the whole day. Keep everyone safe, that's all that matters. And for the work to be of good quality, high quality, to be, to, to be more uh, precise. And... adding three guys from engineer Arman Chua because we have a team of six and we need we need additional manpower so that will bring our manpower to nine plus Abit plus me if they need my help if we'll see but I'll be filming the whole day and uh, hopefully hindi naman kami masyadong ma, ma, mainitan okay lang naman yung init yung ano lang yung pag walang hangin yun lang yung mahirap so yes, yeah, uh, the Lord be with us today. Time check, it's almost 8.30. So si Brother Danny yung nagpapala. Pag napala niya na yung mixture. Hihila ni June. Paakit ng puli. Para makuha ni Ivan. Abot kay Ondo. At kay Wang Yu. Tapos si Mikey magabuhos. Tapos siya. Nakatayo lang.
Ang gagawa mo, May? Uh, pantay po. Okay. So, Mike is making sure that the cement is level. The nylon serves as the guide. And the sky right there is blue. Earlier in the morning, it was blue. But now, if you look at this side of the city, it's a bit grayish. And I hope those are not rain clouds. I really, really hope they, they are not rain clouds. It's a bit gloomy. Not gloomy, but it's just right at the moment. Time check, it's now 11.20. For another 12 hours. 12 hours? Hmm. Are you sure? Hmm. Will Kung the, walang dagdag na helper. Will the guys be able to make it? Pagod. But, pagod yan. So, ang tao natin. Kaya nga. Lord, please sustain them. Darating na. Sana. Oo, sarap ng hangin. Sarap ng hangin. Ganito lang, no? Sana, sana ganito na lang. Lord, sana ganito lang. Pero walang ulan. Ano pong ginagawa niya? Sabi ni Mike, ang tawag daw dyan ay binubuli. Ha? Ano spelling nung binubuli? Bin... Oo. Ano spelling ng binubuli? Binubuli? As in bully? <laughs> As in B-U-L-L-Y? Nakasar. <laughs> B-U-L-L-Y? Binubuli. <laughs> Our reinforcement has arrived. We have four guys. This is Kuya Javier, the one in the white shirt. And that is Fred. Ay, yun, Fred. Yung isa sa inil, pinakagod na kalimutan ko yung name. So, currently it's raining. Pwede pa po ba ito? Nagilip yung ulan? Okay na po ba ito? Magbuhan na nito yung ulan? Okay pa daw. Huwag lang masyadong. <laughs> Pero lumalakas na. <laughs> so, Lord help us po. Na huwag na magtuloy-tuloy yung ulan. So, tatakpan muna nila. Silong muna po. Yung... Wow. So, medyo... <laughs> Pan muna nila. Okay. Uh. And just like that, tumigil na po ang ulan. Nakakubos na kami ulit. But, if you're gonna look at the sky right now, it's a bit Gray. Grayish. Mukhang may iwan around pa. Third building, hindi na ulan. So, it's 1 o'clock. And the sky is back to its original beauty. Look at the clouds. So beautiful. Praise the Lord. Time check. It's 1.40 and we're almost done with one block. Time check, it's 2.30 and we are done with one block. Block ba ang tawag, Mike? Okay. Isa na yan. So, yan na yung isang kwarto at balcony. Malit na balcony. Time check, it's 4 o'clock and they're almost done with another block. So, they're done with that and that one, they're left with 
this one, the second bedroom, that block, and the last one. That's for merienda. Mike, para explain ang gagawin natin. Para magpantay po siya, Ma'am. Okay. Matanggal yung mga lubak-lubak. Bye. Sige, Mike, go. Shy, shy, shy. Okay. So kailangan talaga yung yung surface niya rough hindi siya yung kagaya pag pinalita daw na smooth. Bakit kailangan rough siya? Para po magkapit yung palaman sa tiles mo. Para magkapit yung palaman sa tiles. Oo oh, nga no. Habang, nagbu <laughs> habang nagbubuhos yung mga kasamahan natin, kwentahan mo ko, paano yung buhos sa Dubai? Ako, sa Dubai, although lahat uh, equipment, <laughs> Pero doon, ang buhos doon naabot ng 24 hours. Mm. Mga 6,000 cubic. So itong binubuhos natin ngayon, around 12 cubic lang siya. So mm. sobrang liit. Pero we have to do it manually. Mm. So kaya medyo matagal siya at kailangan mo ng mas maraming manpower. And pagod yung tao. And wow, yung tao. Mm. Hindi katulad doon, although malaki yung buhos sa Dubai, pero lahat equipment. Mm. Ang nakapagod doon yung mag-supervise. Mm -hmm. Kasi dapat checkin mo lahat ng truck. Eh. Every truck, chinecheck yung quality. Inis lang. So, ano yung difference? Kasi ito, sabi mo, dalawang truck. So, yung buhos nyo sa Dubai? Maabot yun ng mga 400 to 500 trucks. Hmm. So, isang, isang buhusan? Isang buhusan. So, isang buhusan matagal, 24 hours. Tapos, ang binubuhusan, ano ba, rough. Hmm. Truck foundation. Hmm. Ma, ano yun, matagal. kailangan yung sequence niya dapat masunod kasi medyo ano yan eh, logistic plan or concrete pouring plan bago ma-execute kailangan ma-approvahan sa konsultan mm. yun ang susundin para ma-avoid yung ano, yung cold joint na sinasabi nila pag nagkaroon ng cold joint yun ang delikasyon mm. tsaka bakit gabi nyo ginagawa? Ayun, kasi di ba yung temperature sa dupan uh, ano siya humid at painit so mayroon lang tawag doon yung ano yung baga yung project specification sinusunod lang doon yung ano yung maximum cold humidity ambient temperature tapos yung concrete temperature maximum 32 degrees so yun kaya as much as, as possible dapat ginagawa sa gabi kasi sa gabi medyo hindi na mainit mas maganda yung weather mas makakontrol yung temperature ng concrete lastly gano karami yung tao na yung datrabaho marami Ah, uh, hindi uh, naman ganoon karami. Ang marami doon yung nagpi-finish kasi di ba pag nabuhusan yan, yung nag nagpi-finish ng concrete. Pero yung manpower mo talaga during concrete yung konti lang kasi may equipment siya. Eh. So, may nagko-control nung ano, concrete pump. Tapos isa rin nagko-control nung ano, yung saan siya naka-pwesto. Tapos yung marami yung nagpi-finish. Okay. Thank you. check it's now 6:35 and malapit na lumubog na rin ang araw or palubog na yung araw the guys are still going strong but of course syempre no pagod na sila si June nakarating na ng batarasa <laughs> Time check, it's now 7.30 and we're almost done. Siguro mga 2 hours na lang. Kumakain muna kami. Kaso gabi na hindi nyo sila makikita. Yan. Pasalamatan muna natin si Kuya Javier. Thank you very much. Sino ba? Si Kuya Fred. Si Kuya Emil. Saka si Kuya Ray. Pauwi na sila. Maka-curfew sila. So, ah, hindi ba lang Lord willing? Hindi sila mga... <laughs>
<laughs> Sana makauwi sila ng maayos. Yan. Salamat po. We are back to our original group. Okay, and we have an import. Hello. Hi to our enforcement. Yan. Ako rin kaya isa lang. Joke lang. <laughs> yeah, lapit na guys. Lapit na. <laughs> Yung bota naka nakasandal lang talaga siya. <laughs> Time check. It's now 12.15 in the morning. So it's 15 past midnight. And we are down to the last one square meter of our buhos. But then we ran out of our uh, cement earlier. No, concrete, reinforced concrete. Tama ba? Reinforced concrete? No, concrete mix. So the guys are doing it manually now because it's already midnight and we don't want to disturb the neighbors anymore. And the last bell there goes to. Si Mam nak tapos. Ingat. Tama ba? Matubig. Matubig? Ibang labas na yun. Thank you very much guys. Ayun may gaman. Tapos na? Tapos na? That's a wrap. Thank you everyone. PM, we are here in the car and inabutan kami ng curfew. Inabutan kami ng curfew, so dito na lang kami matutulog. Good night. Thank you, Lord, for the the I can't even think anymore. Thank you for the sunshine. And thank you na saglit lang yung ulan. Thank you to our team. Thank you. Thanks to everyone. And thank you to everyone who prayed. Good night. Good night.
Hello, it's Thursday. We're back here at the project site. And this is how it looks. This is the end result. Can you tell us what you're doing? Okay. Para hindi siya ma-dehydrate kasi pag ano, nagka-prack. Nadi-dehydrate din ang semento? Siyempre, pag sobrang init. So, kailangan hindi na ililigan siya. Kasi ngayon, nagpapahinga yung mga tao. Pahinga mo na sila. Ikaw mo na yung magtatrabaho. This is the bamboo scaffolding going to roof beam. So, very useful siya. And nakatipid sa scaffolding kasi magamit na siya for roofing. Ngayon, nagkakabit sila ng anilyo sa column para next week makabuhos. Ayan, yung scaffolding niya paikot. Yan yung magiging access natin kapag nagkabit tayo ng roof beam. Ayan. Yung roofing medyo 3-1 man siguro. So that's our update for this week. Wait, are you building your home too? Share with us your Buhos experience in the comment section below. Thanks for watching. See you next week.